Welcome everyone, Joe off RPG here. Today we are going to be playing Dungeons of Edera. Dungeons of Edera is a roguelite action RPG dungeon crawler featuring procedurally generated levels where you will battle hordes of monsters to restore Edera to its former glory. It's going to be a roguelike, it's going to be an RPG. Joaf RPG likes roguelikes, he likes RPGs. It has a very positive rating and it is in early access still getting updates. So we are going to give this one a shot today. So let us see what this game has to offer. Play campaign. Oh, we got three safe slots. Nice. Okay, looks like we have three factions here. There are Bidum, the Suffract, and the Wakara. It looks like these are unlocked during the game. So we get to play as the Arbidum, which have increased health gen, increased chance to harvest plants, and XP bones. Sheldon, I love it. Okay, so we have our our hero Sheldon. How shall our hero Sheldon look? That's Sheldon. That screams Sheldon. See, what screams Sheldon to me? <laughs> this little hair, this, this, like, the way the texture looks, it is just, like, I don't believe that's actually hair. But it looks like it's trying to pretend to be hair. It's great. Okay, we have full beard, uh, a button shop's beard, uh, <laughs> must, these mustaches, yo. Do you want to be a king, or do you want to be a pauper? Your choice. We're, we're going to go with the adventuring outfit. It looks nice. So here we have our mighty hero, Sheldon. Because we always have to customize it. Esquire. The Knight Sheldon. We shall find out his true story. The Arbidum Man, who is a very blonde with weird hair effects. And blonde hair, blue eyes. Oh god, this is going to be great. Okay. Okay, we start off in a little cabin here. Hello. Oh. Recruit fresh from Arbidium Civil Defense Training, the most grueling two weeks of peasant's life. You can trade them, make up in bravery. Do I have money? Oh, I have 7k. You're hired. Uh, that produced him. At max companions. Okay, I was like, can I just hire infinite people? Ah, oh, he's just... Did... Okay, that guy actually does walk. I was like, did that boy just like teleport to me? He's keeping a safe distance. Good, he knows I can't be trusted. Let's talk to this guy. He seems to have a quest. Fishing supplies, difficulty, whatever you want. Okay, non soulbound items lost on death. Enemy health and damage are normal. Standard XP gain. Note for our first quest, we standard seems good. I salvaged some supplies to make a fishing rod and lure. And lure from the wreckage in town, and wouldn't you know it, we already have looters around here. They didn't seem very tough, just scavengers looking for an easy score. Don't just stand there, get after them! Teleportation! Okay, I have a companion barred in my lower left. Where is my companion? Companion? Companion, let us go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Our companion is a fucking ghost. We're gonna, we're, we, we got this. No one can defeat our ghost companion. Shield bash. Go, companion. Save us. Oh. Oh, that hurt. Oh yeah, that did more, more than half our health bar. That was a cool special technique. I want that special technique. Oh god, this is awesome. Yeah! Uh, just like running across Hyrule Fields. Yeah! Okay, it looks like running does not take stamina. Neither does jumping. Dodging takes stamina. I think we alerted somebody just below where we are. I'm climbing on top of the ch- <laughs> I can open the chest wall on top of it. That's awesome. That's fucking awesome. Okay. Looks like there's the enemy. Their AI pathing is terrible. Oh shit, he can do magic. Kill it. Where is our fucking companion? Where's our ghost companion? I spent 250 gold on this motherfucker. Where the fuck is he? Okay, we have a bow, if I remember correctly from randomly clicking stuff. Yeah. 
Okay, let's shoot people. They, oh, our ghost companion shows up. I love, I love the animation of when I jump. It's so great. Whee! I'm a, can I, I, don't know, I cannot break just by jumping. Sad. I love how they all moan to let me know that they, I found, they found me. Uh, kill it. <laughs> Mindlessly charging has always worked. And they're dead. <laughs> Where did the other guy go? There was four of them. Is he, did he, he went up there. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, this game is awesome. Those ragdoll effects. Uh, oh, cool. When I go to switch stuff... Oh, it's in, they're in slow motion. Excellent. Assistant, do something. Okay, just watch me be epic. Yeah, that's why we paid you. I paid you 250... You're not even looking! You're not even looking! I paid good money for you! Assistant? Assistant? He's getting closer, Assistant, and I'm waiting for my arrow to recharge. You're literally going to wait for my arrow to recharge, aren't you? You piece of shit! Can I cheese this? Yes! <laughs> oh. Loot, glorious loot! This looks like a way up. I like how the other guy's just ignoring his friend getting killed. <laughs> and he just jumps randomly. Okay, assistant. Oh, he is the best shield. So now I know. In order to make... That was the weird... Did you see how that gold just... Stuck together and just clomped the way down? Or just... Do it anyway. <laughs> the tall rag physics are the best in this game. Ooh, there's a chest over there. But they're a little... Dot... Where'd his assistant go? That's... Oh, he's just standing down there. Watching me shoot. That little bastard. I guess 250 gold does not get you much. Watch, I sell a single shield to get like 500 gold. And it's like, yeah, he's worth half a shield. Treasure room? Treasure room! I didn't think there would be actually treasure rooms. Oh, yeah. Can I make you carry any of this? I, I just walked straight through him. He really is a ghost assistant. I don't know, man. Let's just run on off into the distance and slay some people. We still have to recover four more supplies. So, gotta get that. We're just gonna back up. Can he knock? He can't cross over! <laughs> oh, this is great. This is great. The AI mapping in this game is perfect. A decorative hat. I gotta see it. Howdy, partner! Oh, can we, can we, uh, can we, can we see? How? Oh, he's camera shy. I'm here to scythe you up good. Yeah, I'm out of arrows, but it's probably better I don't get in the middle of this. I just let him handle this. I paid him money. He's finally actually proving it. It's worth it. Yeah, I don't see any. Ooh, those are horrible. What the? I'm never gonna get used to ghost assistant. Oh, we have potions. I haven't even noticed. That looks janky. Is that an enemy? Is that a? What is this? What is this? Teleport to boss. Ooh, yeah. Feel my wrath. He doesn't look so tough. I bet he doesn't even heal. Oh, he's gonna take more than three? Oh, he has range. Oh, good. Our guy teleported. Okay, I'm gonna rely on you a lot, assistant. Don't you die. Let's see how bad our assistant dies. Okay, he's dying really fast. So we actually need to go in there and help.
Okay. That it? That's what's considered a boss? That was just a normal guy with like just 10 times the HP. Let's see what this giant epic battle arena was supposed to be like before I just fought in a single line. Like, you see the size of this arena and you assume you're going to be having... You're going to have to be running and dodging and fighting hordes of the bosses like help. No, I just fought on a single line. I'm not seeing any treasure. Like, this feels like such a waste of assets. Okay. Activate shrine. Oh! Okay, I get, I get something cool. So, torn service banner. Extra health, extra damage. Um, bless stamina. That's horrible. I'm not even going to read it. 3% bonus damage. Considering I'm only doing about 20 damage, 3% of that is nothing. So, until I'm probably higher level, not because I'm not, I'm only like level 3. We're going to go with these static bonuses. We're going to go with this. Cool. So I gained boon. Is this like a portal back? No. Well, since I can't carry anything more, let's... Get this. Actually, I wonder if I can... Yeah, I can resummon the portal. Excellent. So now I can pick up this. And he's still with me. I wonder if I have to hire him every time, or if he's just with me till he dies. Okay, you have it. Welcome back, my friend. What can I do for you? Did, did that thing just talk without moving its mouth? <laughs> Hold on. Welcome back, my oh God! What can I do for you? They could they could afford voice acting. They could not afford facial animations. I have seventeen thousand. I'm gonna have to go on like. Because I basically got the equivalent of 10,000 money that adventure. Looks like they just created an artificial wall around here. I got past that wall. That was easy. How far does the world go? How far do... Dear companion, I have always loved you. But through our travels... I just can't bear for you not to reciprocate my feelings, how you always teleport, and how I know you're actually not real. The thought of that scares me so much. And so, I must say goodbye. Oh, this is actually solid ground. I know, I know this hurts, I know this hurts you as much as it hurts me, but... I can't live without you, and so I would choose. Not to live at all. Oh god, it actually let me. <laughs> to infinity and beyond! Oh, he's still coming with me! <laughs> you can still see the world. Oh, and we're still getting more meters. The Oh, 140, so we're traveling one meter per second. Is there just infinite falling? Do we respawn? Do we just keep going farther away? Oh my fucking god. Why did they let me do this? Oh god, I'm still falling. And the only reason you can tell is because there's those fucking bars. Oh Jesus. Okay. I can teleport in case your character gets stuck. <laughs> oh! This game is so jank. That is beautiful. That is fucking beautiful. Help us fix the spot you got stuck in. Take a picture of the screen and submit it to our Discord. Oh, no, no. Hopefully the developers watch the video. And you came back with us. That's great. That's just fucking great. I'm glad to know that this game lets me jump off the face of the planet.